Are you digging Vermont? In Chester, Ooh. Vermont. Brother Bob, Bruce Cat. We're gonna try to start a fire. It's snowing out. It's uh, January, February 7th, 2020. And we got a big snow coming on right now and we got no power. It's been over two hours now. So we have electric stove, microwave. We don't have peanut butter and jelly on hand right now. Well, we do, but what are you gonna do? this is more fun. We're going to start a fire one way or the other and cook on our hobo stove, have some hot dogs. We so need some meat. We're bringing you along with us. All right. We'll see ya. Shazam! There we go. Be digging Vermont, be in a snowstorm. Meow! <laughs> We're gonna see what we can do here. Tough conditions, no power. And we're gonna try to spark a fire with a ferro rod. So I'm gonna build a bird nest, see what we can do. We get a lot of snow, it's precipitating hard. We have no way to cook any food, so we actually gotta survive right now. No power, tough, tough times. We made a hobo stove. All right, let's see what happens, yeah. I got some shavings, they're dry. I'm gonna try to cover them up, so excuse me for covering over things here. Another trick, try to cover over your stuff. It's actually pretty crappy conditions. Got some milkweed for the fast flash and we're gonna embed that stuff. Some milkweed I gathered earlier this week. That lights up like you wouldn't believe. Yeah, it goes fast. We're gonna make ourselves a little bird nest out of that and hopefully that's gonna go with my ferro rod because that's what we're gonna start her up with. We have lighters but the real fun is with the ferro rod. I would try the the bow drill but it's just too nasty out here. I would have built the shelter first to be honest with you if I had to. So all right we got some good shavings out here. Yes sir coming down good brother yes sir okay and the stove's underneath but I'm gonna get this lit first if I can got a bayite ferro rod they're not endorsing me at all it just seems to work good <clears throat> alrighty Let's see what we can do here Oh, that looked quick and easy for the Bruce cat. Went well. We got flame, so see how far that'll go. Just kind of let it build, keep it covered. Come on. That is a flame, nice flame right there, folks. Yeah, we gotta, we gotta transfer it to the can. We gotta get it in our hobo stove. Hopefully that will transfer good. I'm gonna keep her covered for another minute here, kinda if I can. Oh, it's taking off pretty good. Get our tinder away from it. We got some other sticks broke up we're gonna try to use. Ferro rod, bayite, beauty. Oh, that's a good one, Bob. That won't fit inside though, until it burns down a little bit. But we want to get him going. This is my uh, hobo stove I made here. We can turn it around. I got some feet to put on it. Don't want to mess with it too much, just want to get it nice and stable. Got some feet I'm going to put on it. Let's see, it's, uh, it's really working good. It's a nice little hobo stove right there. Yeehaw! Power outage! In the big 802. Power outage. <laughs> we'll have hot dogs soon. Essums, of course. Can't Essums beat Essums. They're the best of them. Yes, sir. 
All right, our granddaddy used to say that. I'm gonna get a few more sticks on there because we got some wet wood here. We're really dealing with a trouble situation. Sorta. It's really wet out. We gotta get some nice coals in there, get it burnt down, so we'll probably turn you off and come back. So I got a top piece to, uh, it's down here to set on top of this grill for cooking our hot dogs on, which we're gonna do really soon. We're just getting some uh, coals going here. We'll be back real soon. Shazam! Be digging Vermont. Woohoo! We're cooking tonight again. Me and Bob, that's what we're doing. Hot dogs, Chesta, February 7th, 2020. There's a power outage, big one. No power, we got no grill, no microwave, no nothing. We're cooking hot dogs tonight on the hobo stove we built. So let's get these going. Oh yeah, sizzling already. She's a hot one. Good, good, good runner. There you go, yeah. Yeah, sir. So we're gonna get her uh, a little more wood in there. If you can see, we got a good set of coals. It's going really nice. Very nice. What do you think, Bob? Looks like a beauty to me. The double decker. All right, here's some more wood right here. I'm gonna get that going while you're filming over there. Got a nice hot base. It's kind of falling out a little bit now, but. Uh -huh. There we go. Get them nice dry pieces going. Oh, lots of nice side pieces too. We were gonna use this. Can you see me, Bob? We thought about using the uh, the old cooker because we had such a good fire going, <clears throat> but it settled right down and it came into it nice. So we put the cap on, got a nice little cooker, double decker, nice hobo stove. Kind of stepped it up a little bit. Alrighty. And there she is. Oh, yep, yeah, it's going good. It's really starting to take off good. I like that. How's that look with no light? Lovely. A lot better with no light, I think. Step around there, yeah, huh? Except for the That's dogs. That's a nice stove, Bob. I'm really happy with it. It is. It's doing a great job. If you can't see the dogs cooking, you can hear them cooking. Right. All right, we'll be back soon. Ew, be digging my arm. Ew! Brother Bob, Bruce Cat. We are cooking out January 7th, 2020. Chester Mon, big power outage. We're going on three hours now, but it's all right. We don't need a microwave. We don't need a stove. We don't care. Surviving. Shazam! We've got an awesome double-decker hobo stove which comes apart, comes back together. The hot dogs are cooking good. Let me hand this over to Bob and show you what's happening here. Please do. It's awesome. They are cooking up so fast. I'm gonna rotate them to the back and front. Whoa, don't drop it. These dogs are cooking up good. Wowzers. Almost too good. We're getting burnt hot dogs here, Bob. What are we gonna do? We're gonna eat those suckers. So Bob and I were talking a little bit and we sort of burnt one side of the hot dogs. But don't worry about it. We'll figure it out. <laughs> we're gonna right. eat them. It is a stormy day. Power outage. If you look around, there's no power anywhere. Bob, you can pan around to see the darkness. Yes, yeah, sir. 
Well, look at the fire, it's going awesome here. Wow. The only source of light. We got some good fuel in there. This is great. I like a toasted bun, so I'm probably gonna run in and grab a bun, but these dogs are about ready to come off. I don't know what else to tell you. This is what we do in here. We got some double-decker hobo stove action. It all looks pretty good to me. Shazam. We're gonna, let's spin them over some more. Let's go another row. Since they're going so good. Well, there's the out. They can take some more cooking. Mm-hmm. Alrighty. And there you have it. Shazam, be digging Vermont. Be brother with me. <laughs> Catch you later. Shazam. Shazam! Be digging Vermont, Brother Bob. Yeehaw! Oh. <laughs> Here we go. When hot dogs are done, I gotta I can't resist. I gotta have some grilled buns. I just I like hot buns. What can I say? Hot cross buns? I don't know. Alright, these babies are done. They're real good. Mm-hmm. The old hobo stove. What a gem. It's still going strong too. And we only put, it's the same wood if you guys notice. That's the same wood we put in there minutes ago. Like 10 or 15 minutes ago. It just keeps going. Such a nice little tool. Oh, we can, we'll move that in there like that. Nice. And uh, we got some fine hot dogs here. They came out really good. We did burn one side, but for the most part, they look great. They came out great, and they're gonna taste good. We're eating like champs. So, <clears throat> all right, be digging Vermont. Hobo stove, just cause your power's out, you're not done yet. Uh, we can't bring it inside for heat. We may run out of heat tonight, so wish us luck. We'll be all right. We might be out here behind the hobo stove later if it gets that cold. <laughs> Who knows, all right? I don't know, it's pretty cold out here, dude. Be digging Vermont. Yeah! Shazam!